the end zone, you're obviously pretty happy. Right. Pretty happy from there. Uh, I mean, turn around, uh, look at the big screen, sees the flag. Um, I mean, it is what it is. Um, you know, I wouldn't tell them to change a thing. Honestly, I mean, that's that's what we need out of our defensive linemen. You know what I mean? Uh, you know, they rush and they rush hard. Um, and they help us out a lot on the back end. So it is what it is, you know what I'm saying? So. How much did it call affect you guys mentality as the game progressed? Uh, I mean, did it, did it change, like, the momentum? I mean, probably. Um, but as far as, like, our mentality, I mean, our mentality is, you know, you give us an inch and we'll defend it. Um, so as far as, like, it affecting our mentality of how we play as a defense, I don't think it really did that much. We just had to go, up, go back out there and stop them again, you know what I'm saying? So. You guys put a lot of emphasis on getting revenge for last year's 54-30. Not you per se, but a lot of guys in the locker room, your defensive coordinator, getting revenge for 54-13, stopping the 12-game losing streak against the Pats. What is it? How disappointing is it not to be able to do any of that? Uh, I mean, I didn't even know it was like a streak like that, honestly. Um, I think, you know, it was just a, it was an important game because it was the next game, you know what I mean? Um, and that's a mentality I feel like we had. Um, obviously, it was division opponent, too, so, you know, it was a little heightened, but it's important because it was the next game, um, and, and that's that's really it. Um, so, it is disappointing that we didn't pull it out, but, you know, we get two shots at it, being that we're in the same division. Um, so, whenever that time rolls around again, uh, you know, we'll come back, you know, better. Did you uh, feel like Mac Jones had, I think, a career high six sacks? He got sacked six times. He did. Oh, then yeah. Shout out, shout out to D line and, um, and coverage and rush working together. Uh, but you know they're the ones that get home. So um, you know, kudos to them. Uh, appreciate them. They make our job a lot easier on the back end too. So um, yeah, good job overall. Honestly. What happened in the second half defensively? Obviously, you held them to three points the last play of the first half. Uh, I think we just came out a little, um, a little flat energy wise. Um, we weren't executing at, at the level that, you know, I feel like we have been, you know, the past few weeks early on. Um, and, and I think all that just came from a little, some, some few, um, miscommunications and, you know, that was kind of like the, what dragged us down, you know, early on in the season. So, um, you know how it is, how our defense plays when we're communicating at a high level and everybody's on the same page. So, you know, when we, when we flip that, um, you know, I feel like we got back right. There seemed to be some missed tackles, a lot, a lot more missed tackles, too. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I guess that, that happened as well. Um, but, you know, over the course of the week, you know, we'll address those tomorrow, we'll address it. Um, and be honest with ourselves and about how we can get better. And if it, you know, I'm sure some tackling's in there. Um, that'll be emphasized throughout the week, and you know, put on a better show on next Sunday. When you turned around and saw the flag and the interception with you, like, what were you feeling in that moment? Um, I was kind of just more like, dang, like that was my first touchdown. So you know, it was kind of gone. Um, I guess frustration that. Because I knew how big of a play that would have been, um, more so than than on the flag, but just how how that could have flipped the game and all that stuff. Um, but then it just kind of flipped to okay, like we got however many seconds to keep them from keep them out of the end zone, um, and so that's got to be our our main goal now. So. So you held them to one touchdown today. I mean, regardless of the field goals, what does that say about this defensive unit? Uh, yeah, I, shoot, like, it says, like, you can see when when we're all on the same page and communicating and, um, you know, in tune with each other, and, um, you know, we're hard to drive the whole length of the field against. Um, and so we just got to make sure, you know, we lock, when, when things don't go our way, you know, we continue to lock arms, but also keep having fun. Um, I feel like we kind of got flat energy-wise coming out of the half and stuff like that. Um, and that's been also an emphasis, um, you know, the past few weeks as well. Like, even, you know, highs and lows, you know, just keep doing our thing, keep having fun. 
And, uh, you know, I feel like we we weren't, but then, you know, we kind of revved it up and, and got back into that mode. Uh, so we just got to do it for 60 minutes.